Hello everyone, welcome to Aptu Plus Academy for Civil Services. This is a special video on OS Prelims 2021, which was conducted by OPSC today. We'll be looking into the answer key, the analysis and the cutoff part that is going to be relevant for all the aspirant who have appeared for today's OS Prelims examination. This video will give you a lot more insight and definitely we take care of all the best questions to provide you the authentic answers. So before I start the session, I would like to congratulate all the students who have made this time a success. Seven out of 10 students were there from Aptiplus Academy for Civil Services. Our total selection that we have packed is 305 plus, right? So hearty congratulations to all the aspirants who have made success for OAS 2020. Now, how we'll be moving in this video? This is part one of the video analysis. The total, total two video will be there. The first video will be looking into the first 50 questions with the answers, difficulty level of the questions and the detail about the new mains pattern, which was recently released by the OPS, right? The part two will be released in the late evening. You'll get 51 to 100 questions there, difficulty level of the questions, subject wise vetes of the questions, the bifurcation will be given to you to understand the complete analysis of the questions that were asked by the exam and the current year and the last year paper difficulty level comparison will also be there right so make sure you watch all the video for this part this is video one part one where i'll be discussing question number first to 50. so starting with the question number one we are discussing set number b the first question is international day for the conservation of mangrove ecosystem celebrated on which particular day the option that was provided was 23rd of july 2nd of June, 21st of March and 2nd of February. But the correct answer is not mentioned here and the correct answer is 26th of July. So this question was easy in nature and even you can expect if those of you have marked uh, any of them, you will get the correct answer, right? Second, consider the following statement. Coal ash contain arsenic, lead and mercury. Second, the coal fire plant release sulfur dioxide and oxide nitrogen in the environment high ash is observed in Indian coal. So these were the statement that was provided for this. The correct answer is T. All of them are correct. And this is a medium nature level difficulty question was there. Third question, which of the following are features of the National Ganga River Basin? The river basin is a unit of planning and management. It spearheads the river conservation efforts at the national level. One of the chief minister of the state through which Ganga flows become the chairman of NGRB on the rotational basis. So these were the three statements that were given for the consideration and four options among which the correct option is A, that is statement one and statement two is correct. This is a medium level question. Third question, in terms of efficiency, the most potent greenhouse gas, which among following is the most potent, so the correct answer is T, that is CFC. It's again an easy level question. Fourth, fifth, according to the Selford law of tolerance, the organism wide environmental factor tolerance limit shows the narrow distribution with the low population size. This is this question is also there in the NCRT. If you have read, you can easily answer that. Wide distributions with the population size, narrow distributions of high population size, and wide distributions of the low population size, right? So the correct answer for this is B, that is the wide distributions with high pollution size. The correct answer is, basically the correct answer is B, difficulty level is definitely, this is a difficult question. And even if you have read, you can easily able to answer that. Question number six, that is the inflammatory bowel disease is a group of disorder that cause chronic inflammation in which of the following organ in the human body. The first is intestine, second brain, third kidney and D pancreas. So the correct answer for this is A and this is a medium level question. Question number seven, beyond visual line of sight is an experiment stated with which of the following device. So this particular experiment is associated with which of the following device, naval ship, unmanned air vehicles, submarines and anti missile. So you might get confused, but the correct answer is UAV. Now in Italian, which of the following shape is acquired for a molecule, whether it is a linear, 
tetrahedral, coplanar, triangular, or hectohedral. So the correct answer for this is C. Now, ninth number question. Name the new tool that is aimed at matching the potential voted to the new clinical trial. The first, country without COVID. Second is world with less COVID patients. Third, goal without COVID. And the last D option is world without COVID. So the correct answer is D. And this is again an easy question. Question number 10. The world first floating nuclear plant was developed by which of the following countries? That is Russia, India, China and United States. So it's an easy question. And the answer is A. Which of the following causes is responsible for the production of 1500 light away from the radiocarbon in the atmosphere? This is question number 11. And the option were atmosphere lighting discharge in the atmosphere, acting of ultraviolet from the sun on the atmospheric oxygen, actions of solar radiation, particular cosmic rays on the carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, and D, that is a collision between the fast neutron and nitrogen nuclei present in the atmosphere. So the correct answer is definitely D. This is a difficult level question. Now, question number 12, which was the active medium used for the first working laser ever constructed? So the options were diamond block, helium, neon gas, ruby rod, or carbon dioxide gas. So the correct answer is ruby rod. 13. Unicorn is the name of which of the space body that recently discovered 1500 light year away from the earth. The first option is exoplanet, black hole, asteroid or satellite. So the correct option here is black hole. Now what is Patania 2 which was recently seen in news for being standard in the Pacific Ocean floor. The first option is container ship, submarine ship, mining robot or satellite module. So the correct answer is a mining robot. 15 number question, which of the following has acquired a signal arrival messaging app Wicca? Which, which company is actually the owner? The first option is Google, second is Amazon, third is Microsoft and fourth is Apple. The correct answer is Amazon. This is again an easy question. 16 number question with reference to GHO GM Foreign Minister Plain Tree 2022 meeting. Which among the following statement is correct? The Foreign Minister Plain Tree meeting was held in Jamaica. The theme for the meeting was democracy, peace and governance. It was attended by India's external affairs minister, Mr. S. J. Shankar. And the meeting is held every year. So you have to basically choose the option which among the following is correct. For this particular question, the correct option is D, that option number 2 and 3 are correct. Question number 70, which two of the following statements are not correct? National Investigation Agency, also known as NIA, is a primary counter-terrorist task force in India. It was established on November 38, 2006. It does not permission for the respective state to investigate and it has a branches in Lucknow and Calcutta. So you have to check for the correct option. Basically, this is again an ambiguity in the answer. And none of this has been is correct answer. We are expecting that question number option number two or option number four might be correct. So this is again a medium level of question. Question number 18, which of the following statement are correct in respect to India's GSAT 24 satellite launching? It's a 24 KU band communication satellite. It was launched by the Kurop Space Center in French Guinea. It provided with the coverage to Pan India. It was launched by ISRO rocket GSLV Mark III. Which among the following is correct? Among all the four options, the correct option is B. That option number first, second and third is correct. This is again a medium level question. Now the SEBI has set up the advisory committee on hybrid security. In respect to the hybrid security, which among following statement is correct? The hybrid securities are the securities that has the combination of debt and equity characters. The stock, common stock, are the first type of the hybrid security. The holders of the common stock receive the dividend before the holders preferred the stock. And the hybrid security are the way of bank companies to borrow money from the investor. This was there recently in the news. So this is a current affair question come economy question. The correct option for this particular question is C, that is option number one and option number four. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट आर नॉट करेक्ट विद रेस्पेक्ट टू वन नेशन वन राशन कार्ड सो बिफोर यू अटेम्प दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन मेक श्योर यू रीड विच अमंग द फॉलोइंग इज नॉट करेक्ट राइट सो द थीम हैज बिकम ऑपरेशनल इन करेक्ट द स्कीम हैज एक्चुअली बीन ऑपरेशनल इन इंटायर इंडिया दिस इज वॉट द स्टेटमेंट वॉज आस्ट सेकेंड आसाम बिकम थर्टी फोर स्टेट टू ऑप्ट ओ एन ओ आर सी दिस मूव हैज मेड इंडियाज फूड सिक्योरिटी पॉपिबिलिटी and the ration card are nationalized using the voter identity cd so you have to go for the correct option and among all the options provided the correct option is second and fourth 21 according to the asia global startup ecosystem report which was released on june 14 2022 which among the following indian state has been ranked with the first position in india the first option is andhra pradesh tamil nadu madhya pradesh and kerala for this the correct option is d this is a easy level question 21st with respect to the brics 2022 summit which was held on the virtual mode which among the following statement is correct the meeting top the foster quality brics partnership ushered in the new for development global partnership vladimir putin said that russia is ready to promote close and versatile interaction with the brics partners Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi has said that the member should understood the security concern for each another and provide the mutual support. And the last statement that was provided is that Chinese President Xi Jinping welcomed the expanding military ties among the BRICS. So, which among the following is the correct one? The correct option is A. Option number one, two, and three. This is again a current affair question. Twenty-third number question in respect to Exxon Quest 2022, which was. Which among the following statement is correct? It is a multinational peacekeeping exercise. It was conducted on March six to twenty. It was held in Ulan Bator, Mongolia, and Indian contingent was represented by the personnel from the Kashmir Scouts. So, which among the following is the correct? The correct option is three. This was also discussed in our monthly magazine, IAS Gazetted Magazine. अगर आप if you are referring to the blogs also, you must be easily able to answer this question. Moving to the question number four, that is International Day of Yoga is observed on every twenty first June. Which among the following statement is correct with regard to International Day for Yoga? Which among the following is not a correct option? Again, there is a catch. They have asked which among the following is not correct. So the observation of International Day of Yoga was started in two thousand sixteen. The UN mandated day celebrating for yoga was put by the Prime Minister of India. This day is incepted. This day is also considered for the inception for UN. General Assembly in 2015 and 21st June is selected as a yoga day because this is the longest day in the year in the southern hemisphere. So, which among the following is correct? The correct option is A. This is again a medium level question. Question number 25: Innovation project called National Initiative for Promoting Upskilling Nirman Worker. Which among the following is correct? Which was recently launched in June 2022. So the options provided that this was launched for. skill training for the first uh, almost close to 1 lakh construction worker it was launched under the flagship scheme of the prime minister employment generation program the scheme will provide work opportunities to them in the foreign countries also and the scheme will be implemented by the national skill development corporation so the correct option for this is a question number 26 pick up the wrong matching in respect to the new chief justice of the high court appointed recently vipin Justice Vipin Sanghai, Uttarakhand; Justice Uday Budhwan, Telangana; Justice Satish Chandra Sharma, Rajasthan; Justice Rashmi Maharani Chaya from Guwahati. Which among the following is basically they have asked pick the wrong one. So the correct answer here is C. Question number twenty-seven. PME with their program was launched by the Ministry of Education in May twenty twenty. Which of the following is a major initiative of this program or not correct? So most of the question asked is against the not correct one. So Disha one. nation and multi digital platform swayam prabha tv channel special e content for visual hearing and part extensive partnership and parent association in the school management the correct answer for this particular question is answer number a option number 1 in which of district of gujarat india's first ever grill panchayat called balika panchayat was started so the options are kutch baruch Naushari or Ahmedama. The correct answer for this particular question is A. That is Kutch. Question number twenty-nine. That is the 
Kuvsugl Lake National Park of Mongolia has been added to the World National of Bio Reserve by UNESCO. In respect to this, which among the following statement is correct? In this particular question, the correct option is asked. The decision was taken on 26th, 36th session of International Council, the Man and Biosphere Reserve Program. This program was held in Paris in June 2022. The Biosphere Network was launched by UNESCO in 1971. The first Biosphere Reserve in the world was established in 1975. The correct option for this particular question is B, that is option number 2 and 4. Question number 30, Reserve Bank of India has released a vision of architecture for digital finance in the document of payment system that was released on July 17, 2022, which among the following statement is correct. This is a called payment vision document 2025. This document includes biotech, fintech and the payments. It includes bio, basically Bitcoin currencies. It delinks credit card with the unified payment interface. For this particular question, the correct option is B, that is option number three and four. Now, question number 31. This is a match question. We have to match column number one and column number two. So for this particular question, the option is C. The question was asked as a portation of Malu. This is from Punjab, Master Tara Singh, Jharkhand, Sibu Soren from Andhra Pradesh. So the correct answer here is C. Question number 32. Henderson Brook Bhagat report, the Arjun Nehru report respectively pertain to which among the following? You have to identify the correct option. The Sino-India relation after independence and the reform needed to management of Indian armed forces. Reform needed in India's foreign relation and reform in the center state relations. Indo-Pak relations that is Indo-China relations and Sino-India engagement. In 1962 reform needed to the management of Indian armed forces. So the correct answer is definitely D. This is again a medium level question. Now match the column again with the political leaders and political parties. Shyama Prasad Mukherjee with the Swatantra Party, Pillow Modi, that is the Congress Social Party, Ram Manohar Roya, Bharti Jantasan. The correct option for this is answer D. Question number 34, by the popular title used Sheikh Mohammed Abdullah, he wrote Venkat Rama, Vallabhai Patel respectively, which among the following is the correct one, which among the following title was given. So the correct option here is option number A, that is Sere Kashmir, Periyar and Sardar. Question number 35, which among the following princely state of India were known for the reformist policy? The correct option is B, that is Tevin Core Barcode, right? Question number 36, Raja Ravi Verma and the Raja Ram Mohan Roy was respectively the ruler of Kulin and the ruler of Brigeshwar, found the feminist movement in India and the founder of Brahma Samaj, an artist and the author of Ultu Ul Mujahideen, Editor of Shamad Kamuti and the editor of Mirat Ul Akbar. The correct option here is B, the founder of feminist movement in India and the founder of Brahma Samaj. Question number 37, Nehru Mahalanobis model was concerned with the planning of the Indian economy, the development of Indian culture, improvement of Indian economy, the development of Indian foreign policy. This is the easiest question. The correct option here is A. Now, 38, the Patola weave were traditionally done. Choose the correct combination. You have to choose the combination. Pachamalli and Kanchipuram, Surat, Patan, Patan, Ahmedabad, Dekka, Banaras, Banaras, Pitan. So the correct option for this particular question is answer number B, that is 2 and 3 are correct. Question number 39, Muslim League accepted the Lucknow Pact but rejected the Nehru report because one offered Muslim more representative than the proportion were actually the proportion of their population while order did not. Second option of the fear Muslim being punished and the colonial government of this all ally with the government was there and this trust what the insist was Hindu leadership of Congress. The correct option for this particular question is D. Question number 40, which among the following part is a part of the Indian constitution relation between union and the states finance, property, contract and suits, trade, commerce and intercourse with India and the fundamental right. The correct option here is D, that is first, second, third and fourth. Question number 41, what are the common to Catherine Mayo, Aludis Alexi and Charles Andrews and William Du Bois? So they wrote commentaries on the conditions of India during the British rule. They supported Indian national movement. They were opponents of Indian national movement and they were friends of Mahatma Gandhi. The correct option is A. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी टू सर सैयद अहमद खान अपोज टू द मुस्लिम ज्वाइनिंग कांग्रेस बिकॉज ही फियर दैट दिस विल दिस कुड अट्रैक्ट द रिटेलिएशन फ्रॉम द ब्रिटिस्ट ही सस्पेंडेड द कांग्रेस दैट वुड डोमेन द हिंदूज द सस्पेंशन वॉज दैट द कांग्रेस वुड बी डोमिनेटेड बाई हिंदूज एंड ही डिड नॉट like the idea of opposing the british and he was a separatist again this is a medium level question the correct option is a question number 43 that is which of the following regional political parties were first able to form the government in which of the following state so the first is dmk akali dal mnm that is mizo national front and again is anna dravid mudgagam so the correct answer for this is option number a 44 das is an excavated site in odisha which yield facets across chills ponders maize and the grinding stone which among the following option is the correct one so for this particular question you have to choose the correct option the correct option in this is option number c that is kulai right that is kuchai is the correct option now question number 45 match the column with the column number 1 and column number 2 Al Masudi, Fain, Huayn, and Al Baduda. So you have to choose the correct option. The correct option here is B. Question number forty-six. Which among the following issues are not taken into account while discussing the concept of sea floor? Volcanic activities along mild ocean ridges, distribution of fossil in the different tail contents, stripes of the normal and reverse magnetic field observed in the rocket of the floor, ocean actually rockets in the ocean flows, age of the rock. rocks from the ocean flow so the correct option basically none of them is correct all can be taken into account as a correct option question number 47 the streams which do not follow the regional slopes and drain across the geological structure is called subsequent stream second is requent stream insequent stream or consequent stream the correct option is c that is insequent stream Question number forty-eight. According to Weber, which is the most factor in locating a factory, that is a raw material, transport cost, algomissions, or labor. The correct option is transportation cost. Question number forty-nine. This is again a match column. So, Burchan is a coastal, mender, glacial, saddle, eluin, stack, fulvin. Correct option for this particular question is option number B. And fifty number question. Population distribution of rural and urban area is shown by hectograph, echograph, dots and square, or line graph. The correct option for this is dot and graph. This is again a easy question. So I have this. I have discussed fifty question. We'll be looking into other from fifty one to hundred question in the second part of the video. But before that, let me tell you about the new examination pattern which was recently released by the OPSC. Now the qualifying papers is Odia language that contain 300 marks and English language that is again 300. Now the paper which will be counted for the merit list that include the list of paper where four paper is there from the general studies and one optional right. So essay will comprise of 250 marks. General studies each paper will comprise of 250 marks right. You'll have one optional now instead of two optional there will be one optional. Optional paper comprise 250 and 250. So total written is seventeen hundred fifty, and there will be a personality test that will comprise of two hundred seventy five marks. So the total grand total that is two zero two five will be taken into consideration once you are selected and the ranking is made. Now before I end this session, those of you are looking forward for upcoming prelims, basically prelims and also for the mains for this particular year. we have a courses for you opsc prelims test series 2022 and opsc mains test series for this particular mains which will be coming and there is a opsc classroom program from where faculty from delhi teach you give you the best guidance the best possible guidance that can be provided is from the aptiplus we ensure quality and quality so you can have a contact details you can share the details you can contact them they will provide you the complete information about the opsc classroom program for more details you can check out the numbers and even you can reach out to our website so this was all about for the part 1 see you in the second part and if you are new to our channel do not forget to subscribe apt plus academy for civil services on youtube if you like this video if you find this video informative and helpful do not forget to press a like button thank you so much for watching this video